Hey guys, it's me Noelle and welcome back to my channel. Peep that new intro. Very first video of the year. Sorry I kind of disappeared for like a month. So fun fact about me, I don't do my hair and you probably know that from my past videos. I kind of just let it air dry out of the shower. I don't really own heat tools or anything. But over the break, I got this heat tool and I'm kind of in love with the look of it. So in this video, I'm going to be reviewing Bedhead's Wave Artist Ceramic Deep Waver. Look how cool that, like, is that not an interesting looking shape? Another fun fact, I kind of really suck at using straighteners and curlers. So this hopefully provides me a solution. It's basically like a crimper, like a, like it clamps your hair and you don't have to do any like twirly motion or anything. This was only $25 at Target. I'll link it in the description below. I'm kind of decimating the packaging. There's probably a better way to do this. So for the longest time, I did not know how to open the tool. I'm like, did I get a faulty one? There is a lock. There you go. That, okay, that makes sense. All right, unfortunately, this does not come with a little glove and I really like when they have gloves, um, but that's okay. You know what, fine, I'll read the instructions. Just so I don't, you know, accidentally burn my hair off. It tells you the heat level you should do based on your hair type. I should put it on medium, so I guess that's important. But how do you know? There's a little dial here. You guys see that? Oh, it's telling me. Oh, oh <laughs> it's not on. Make sure you turn it on. <laughs> see? There you go. It's on. Um, and there is no light indicating that it's on. Right. So you just have to, oh, there is a light that's indicating it's on. <laughs> this, this dial is like extremely confusing. Like it doesn't tell you where you're at. If you spin it all the way to the right, you'll go all the way low. I guess it also depends on the look you're going for. If you want super defined waves, put it on high. If you want like more natural, subtle waves, put it on low. I am gonna go with a medium setting, but it's kind of weird because you kind of have to guess. Make sure you brush your hair first to get rid of all the tangly tangles. Uh, <laughs> this video is extremely unhelpful. There's this little textured area here that I'm pretty sure you put your thumb in so you can easily clamp it, which is convenient. All right, take a section of your hair, make sure it's dried. I'm really scared, guys. And then literally, put it between the heat tool and you clamp down and i don't know how long you're supposed to do it for okay go back ow ow oh, frick, frick, frick. careful careful with yourself you know what i think that's good enough who is she is she a mermaid i think so so as you can see this part's straight so you're just going to continue going down until you reach the bottom of your hair and if you want to continue with the pattern you need to like line it up properly if that makes sense I'm gonna have uneven hair because I'm not counting. <sighs> okay. Yeah, as you could see, uneven because I didn't line it up right. Okay, it's extremely uneven. <sighs> okay, it's okay, we're gonna continue, guys. It's helpful to have clips, which I don't have. When God made me, he said, no coordination. He's like, nope. Also, this might be an obvious fact, but the thicker the piece of hair you grab, the longer you should wait to get the same amount of curl. <laughs> this is so bad. I just wanted to look cute. It's not even the tool. The tool is doing its job. It's great. Like I'm actually really impressed with this tool, especially for the price point. However, the skill of me is hindering this entire process. I mean, do you guys see what I'm going for? It's kind of like a wavy wave. Almost. Okay. Okay. I mean, yeah, effort is there, right? It's not bad, guys. Come on, let's just... 
She's kind of cute though. Wow, I kind of felt myself in that frame. So my issue is the back. I'm supposed to do the back of my head. Okay, so first I started really low and I wanted it higher, but it's too late. It's too late. Okay, oh, that was a long time. So it's been like 25 minutes and I've gotten two strips done. What is happening? What is this? Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? We're gonna go to the high session section. We're going higher than what we have. Okay, that's a little better. So that's the video. I Let's pretend I didn't do the rest of my hair because I genuinely need help. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was kind of all over the place. Not sure if you got exactly anything out of it. Hopefully you enjoyed watching me struggle and I encourage you to buy Bedhead. I mean, this tool is great. Definitely 10 out of 10 in my opinion. I just need to learn how to use it properly and then I'll get back to you guys. I'll try my best to go back to the video a week for you guys. Thank you guys for 4,000 subscribers. I cannot believe it. That's amazing. YouTube, where's my play button at? Mm -hmm. Where is it? <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe button. And let me know in the comments down below if you would buy this. If I convince you to buy this. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Okay, that was a fail.